You're watching Telecom TV from the Great Telco Debate 2018 and joining me now is Sanjay Mawada, Chief Strategy Officer at Netcracker. Sanjay, thanks for joining us on Telecom TV. We've been talking about SDN and NFV for a number of years now and Netcracker has been there from the very start, but why is this all taking so long? Well, when you think of SDN and NFV and virtualization in general, on the network side, it's not a trivial problem. Right? Um, it requires major transformation. Transformation, of, obviously, of the new technology that you're bringing in, but also in terms of the business, the business processes. And so carriers are not in the habit of, let's try it and see if it works, um, kind of a model. For something as mission critical as your B2B services or B2C services, if you're going to move to the next generation of technology, you want to make sure that you're doing it right. Uh, you are spending enough time on making, building the right business cases, doing the right proof of concepts, selecting the right set of vendors. All of that takes time. Is this long time to market really a problem for CSPs? In some cases, it absolutely is, especially in highly competitive markets where because of cloud and virtualization, there are non-telecom players who are coming over the top offering SD-WAN-like services, offering a range of enterprise applications. And situations like that where you don't have the luxury of time, oftentimes you don't have the luxury to do the continuous due diligence, to run the proof of concepts, to choose the right vendor, to run small trials before you go commercial, you are in a bind. How do you go to market quickly? How do you go to market with the right set of services without having to spend a year and a half, two years, in some cases almost as three years to transform and move towards virtualization. So how is Netcracker helping here? We have introduced um, three months ago um, and with four commercial deployments, it has been a major, major development uh, in the industry. We have introduced the Netcracker Business Cloud and which is offering SDN NFV, the full virtualization stack not just the network, but also the orchestration, as well as the BSS, including billing, customer care, a full suite of enterprise applications, all offered as a service over the cloud in a multi-cloud environment. So what it does is, for those operators who are facing the challenge of go-to-market, who are facing the challenge of getting a solution out there and offering out there as quickly as possible. Things like SD-WAN, things like a range of enterprise services for their B2B, their most important market, they now have a choice to offer it as a service using Netcracker Business Cloud. You mentioned multi-cloud. Why is this important? For a number of reasons. Um, when you think of a full stack in the cloud, perhaps not as much. But that's not always the case. I talked about four customers of ours. A few of them have gone multi-cloud, whereby due to regulatory reasons, or oftentimes they have a very robust data center environment of their own, they can host certain parts of the network, certain parts of the IT layer in their cloud or in a third party cloud, while a number of other solutions are offered through Netcracker Cloud. So multi-cloud environment is critical. Uh, you cannot put a gun to a service provider's head and say, you can only do this through a unique one cloud solution, single stack. No, you have to give them the flexibility to go multi-cloud. You have to give them the flexibility to pick and choose what layer do they want of that full stack. Whether you want the network, whether you want orchestration, whether you want the front end BSS, and any of them can be in any parts of the cloud, public cloud, private cloud, or on premise. What makes the Netcracker Business Cloud a game changer? Oh, it's a complete game changer. It's the first in the industry, um, as I said. Um, for the first time, you get a full suite of SDN and FE services and enterprise application services delivered through the cloud. So it takes care of a number of business challenges and it takes care of a number of technology challenges. So from a business challenge perspective, if speed to market is an issue, if you are facing an extremely competitive market, and you need to get out there and start offering the next generation of services, but don't have the luxury of either your CapEx or OpEx, or you don't have the luxury of having to run large proof of concepts, if you don't have the luxury and the time to reorient your organization to deliver these next gen of services, but you can't wait because of competitive pressures, this finally gives an option to operators to say, you know what, let's put it, let's use it as a service from the cloud using Netcracker Business Cloud, and then as it grows, 
and become successful we can bring it in in a build operate transfer model or continue to scale it uh, the way it is right now so it's a complete game changer because finally it offers this alternative to operators who say you can do it yourself take the time do all the due diligence do it the traditional way or you can quickly start introducing these services by using Netcracker. So that is um, why it is a game changer. Um, that is why it is so transformative. And most importantly, it gives them the flexibility of going over the top, going in with new business models, going in with new technology without having to spend years and years mastering it. Sanjay, thank you very much indeed. Good to talk to you.